Hello. Welcome to Flip It or Keep It. I'm going to show you what I've been up to. <laughs> okay, back to my floor. So, it's not all sticky anymore. And I'm thinking of keeping, like, this kind of a contrast. I was going to do it all this with the black and the, um, and the gray. I still have to park, see the dark squares and make them shine. That's just a base paint. And I said it's kind of dark. And I kind of like the contrast here. <laughs> so I'm going to keep it like this. But I'm going to go over the, what I just showed you, you know, the black squares there with some epoxy and do a new epoxy here. The sink ended up coming out. I already did a video that I got copyrighted, so I took it down. So I'm just repeating some things. Um, I did this one. Looks like I'll be all set for Halloween next year at least. <laughs> Looks like a huge spider web. My husband said he's going to take some tarantulas and just like hang them down here. <laughs> I'll let them drop when people come over. And this is my Jason Pollock, um, um, what do you call it, drip painting <laughs> to go with it. So there's that. And I put a little Christmas uh, thing here. We had everybody over here for Thanksgiving. This is just a uh, Dollar Tree thing, but full of holes. But I liked it up against my blue bowl over here. And we had a great time, everybody here. And I still have the um, Thanksgiving tablecloth out, but I got to put some things away. I put a lot of things away already, but I still have to put that other tablecloth over there out. Um, while we're here, this is a lava lamp that it's okay. It has three like lava balls that go around each other, but it's a little boring. And I have another one that's not doing anything at all. That's boring. So I'm thinking of, I, I got these all in a lot. If you didn't see the other video, um, like 13 lava lamps. And this one is okay, but I wouldn't sell it. I don't sell just okay. <laughs> um, the other one, I'm not happy with at all. So what I'm thinking of doing is taking them apart, emptying out a little bit of the water, cleaning the inside glass with a toothbrush, a soft toothbrush, and then adding some distilled vinegar to it and maybe some food coloring. Uh, I'm gonna practice on the one that's very plain, that's not doing anything. I'll do that first. The light bulbs seem okay. So I hate to change the light bulb if it's not that, and I can fix it another way. That'd be my last resort. So then the other thing I have here are CDs. I won them at auction. I got the CDs and over 600 CDs, um, a CD cabinet. I'll bring them over here and show you this right here. CD cabinet. And just took the shelves out to move it. And they're really very lightweight. So I don't know. I don't really need them right now. I'm going to be selling most of these. But all of these right here I'm keeping. I have a bag of CDs under there. One under there. I'm not going to dig for my boxes again. This is the bag I'm working on right now. I still have this bag, this box, and another bag back here. This was filled with them. I finished that one. And there's another bag inside of here that I finished. So I'll show you what I'm going to do with that in a minute. I love these uh, pillow pillows that I got at Savers. That one and that one. Thank God I have all these pillows. I have everybody over and my chair's not very comfortable. All right, so in here where it's nice and dark, maybe I should turn the light on. We'll do the lava lamps first, right here. It's a really pretty one, it sparkles. Let me get closer on it. And we're keeping this one. And it's a stereo that I got from the lady too. And I also got this. Um, it's a Woodstock uh, poster sign and Live Aid here. Well, this is the remote that came with it. Just have it there, and this is mine anyway. I love this thing. <laughs> I just keep it out here. It's kind of cool. And the Live Aid. So I have all these CDs. I'm going to turn the light on. But first, I want to show you my other lava lamp. Hi, Benji. Benji, say hi. <laughs> um, this one is actually turned out to be really cool. I like this one. I just put it on today. And for it to be activating this well, this early, I have high hopes for this. I don't know if I'm going to be able to sell it. 
really like this one. I saw another lamp. It was a really cool electric wave lamp. I don't need it for me. You know, I just, but I just don't need it. But it's a motion when the wave goes all the way to one side and then it goes back to the other and it has like a bubble vessel on the top. Really cool. We sold out one. I'm gonna turn the light on, show you the CDs. Um, first of all, I bought all these extra standard jewel cases um, because some of my cases are cracked. And I started um, figuring out what each one's worth. Like the, these are seven, this stack's eight, that stack's nine, that stack 10, 12, 15, 20, and 25. And what I want to do is as I get 30 of each amount, list them on eBay. And I've already started drafting them. So they know I want to do like a set of 30, $4.99 a piece or $5.99 a piece, whatever I'm doing. And my, my problem is I'm really worried. I don't know if it's going to automatically come up so the customer can pick what they want out of that. I don't know. But those are going to be my starting prices. I based it, I looked everyone up. I based it on what everybody else was selling theirs for. And if somebody sold theirs for four plus four dollars shipping, then I looked at it as that CD is being valued at eight. Um, because after they paid the shipping and handling for just one CD, the rest is going to be free. So that's how I'm going to do that. I got this one. This is an orchestra tape in my, um, my uncle loves classical music, so I offered that to him. He said, yeah, he'll take that. <laughs> so if I come across any more like that, I'll, I'll ask him if he wants it first. Um, and I think that's about it on the lava lamps. The one upstairs really isn't worth um, walking up the stairs to go show you. I'm hoping it's going to activate. I don't know. We will see. All right, so it's a short video today. You know, I'll think, oh, let me just show you Mozzie. I don't know if I showed you Mozzie in another video. I think I did. That's my Mozzie statue. I love him. Absolutely love him. He scares the heck out of me, though. I come down here at like 12 o'clock at night to close up. Or any time. I'm just like thinking of something else. So, yeah, I'll show you. So I come around the corner like this. And I see him in the corner of my eye. And I go, who's that? <laughs> He scares me. My sister-in-law doesn't understand why that scares me. He's so cute. How can he scare you? Like, you try coming around the corner at 1230 at night and see somebody peeking at you underneath a table. <laughs> He'll jump too. All right. Well, I am out of here. I love my fireplace. <laughs> I love that. All right. I'll talk to everybody later. And goodbye.